Buffalo Catholic Bishop Richard Malone is now denying reports, claiming he is about to resign. This comes as he's expected to meet with the Pope at the Vatican tomorrow to talk about the sex abuse crisis here in the Buffalo Diocese. Tonight, I-Team Chief Investigator Charlie Specht has the latest on the story. The people of Buffalo, especially the survivors of sexual abuse, should be rejoicing today and hoping and praying that what we're hearing out of Rome is true. Reports from Rome that Bishop Malone could be resigning in the next few days are being greeted with relief from victim advocate and former priest Bob Hotson. That Bishop Richard Malone may never ever return to Buffalo, New York, except to move his belongings somewhere else. Hudson says the removal or resignation of the bishop while he meets with Pope Francis in Rome would send a signal to abuse survivors that their voices are finally being heard. The healing of the victims is, is assisted and people in the pews now can say, well, at least we have a man who will tell us the truth. Uh, this man has done just the opposite time after time after time. The reporters in Rome say the recently completed Vatican investigation paints a damaging portrait of Bishop Malone's management of the diocese. You know, when the, the chief shepherd of the diocese is, is not leading the flock or is actually um, causing damage, then there is a problem, and I think the Vatican is seeing that. Christopher Lamb is the tablet's correspondent in Rome. His report of a, quote, imminent resignation was refuted Thursday when Chris Altieri, Rome bureau chief from the Catholic Herald, tracked down Bishop Malone on the streets of Rome. When I looked up, uh, there were uh, Bishop Malone and Bishop Gross. So I walked over to them and uh, greeted them and asked Bishop Malone if there's any truth to the rumor that he had submitted his resignation. He told me that was absolutely false, said thank you very much, uh, that's the end of our conversation, and uh, went on his way. Whatever the procedure, the attention of the American church is now focused on the actions of bishops like Malone. This is the next the next layer of outing, of exposition that we're going to see in our church, and that's the hierarchy. We're finally getting to the heart of the matter. At some point there has to be a reckoning, and the church's house will be clean, uh, but the question is uh, whether it will be churchmen or Caesar who do the cleaning. When you bury the truth, uh, the truth will eventually come out, and it has. And here we are. For the I-Team, Charlie Speck, 7 Eyewitness News.